That's a good start, isn't it? I just hit the crystal chandelier. Hello, you gorgeous people of the interwebs, and welcome to my March vlog. It's March. The days are getting longer. Soon the clocks will be going forward, and I shall be suffering that one hour loss in time. It gets me every year. Um, yes, so much vlog. Oh, so much is going to happen. We've got very exciting. Our road is going to be resurfaced outside. Yes, that's true. I have ordered things. That's also true. <laughs> um, I've got a hair appointment. Darby and I have got massages booked. Um, it's all happening. Yes. And uh, my room is in... A bit of a mess. Ooh, what a mess, what a mess. I've just, well, I'm just finishing up work. I have knocked off officially, but I'm um, in the middle of a conversation with someone. So I'm just waiting for that conversation to close and then I can switch off my work laptop. And that's why I'm not showing you my desk. Speaking of work, because I'm going into the office two days, there's the conversation. The call is complete and I am officially done for the week. Woohoo! Okay, I'm um, trying really hard not to put extra hours in all the time. I've had a couple of days, I've had a few days where it's been so nuts that I've had to chuck in a couple of extra hours. Um, but I'm not making a habit of it because if they wanted me for more hours per week, they'd pay me for more hours per week. That's what I say. But what I was going to say is because I'm going into the office two days a week, I am able to mix things up with my bags. And I am, oh, oh, look at these. I need to get rid of those lovely flowers that were sent to me by some friends of ours to say congratulations on the new job because we hadn't told them about the new job. We hadn't seen them. Um, uh, right, so I have been using lots of different bags of the day. For example, in the last couple of weeks, I have used Ms. Moschino. I have used me Alexander McQueen. I have used Ms. Versace. I've used this long shop that's down here in amongst all the mess. I have even used my tiny little Prada pouch when I haven't been taking lunch in. So yeah, that's been a lot of fun being able to actually use some of these beauties a little bit more. Now, I've had a delivery today. Should we go and have a look? This is a box full of various things from, yes, you guessed it, nah, 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 John Lewis. So I have bought quite a few things. I was planning on doing a bit of a fashion show, but I started and then it was just like, just so much. Gosh, it's a lot. Oh yeah, jeans. I've ordered some fat face jeans and some Levi's. So I've got a few bits there. I've got a few bits that I had already bought that I want to share with you. I picked up a couple of really good bargains, but I just didn't do a fashion show. These things instantly, they're going back. This t-shirt was massive. And the pale pink was just horrible on me. I've got three pairs of jeans here. Uh, trying to find jeans is just the absolute worst. This pair is um, a fat face, size 18 in a short. And they were really quite baggy around the middle. And these are some Levi jeans. Let's zoom in on that. These are 725 high rise boot cut. And these only come in one length. And I don't know who they think is trying them on, but it ain't someone with little legs like me. It's not someone with long legs. It's someone with really long legs. But again, these I had ordered in an 18 and a 20, and they are too big. These are the other bits in the same order. This is the Aesop Post Poo Drops. And these are a, I'm going to say it, this is a basic human right. This is brilliant for once you have been to the lavatory, you drop, you hit the little pipette there, squeeze it, and then you drop a few little things in the pan after you flushed, and wow, what a difference. It's absolutely amazing. Live by these, always have them in the house. And this nail varnish is OPI. You know OPI is my favourite. And this is the colour, two-timing the zones, and 
online this looks bubblegum pink and this is not bubblegum pink this kind of looks like it's faded powder pink so that's going back that's a disappointment and here are some things I have collected over the last couple of weeks um, that I'm happy with and you are going to notice that most of them are green you know I am a massive fan of the Marks and Sparks cheap and cheerful hoodie jogger sets so I bought another one this is my fourth and it is in this kind of dark green I don't know if the colour is going to come up particularly well but uh, if you're looking through the viewfinder it's coming up a bit bit sort of washed out but it's not um, so it's this gorgeous gorgeous green looking forward to wearing that this is a black t-shirt just a plain and simple black t-shirt from John Lewis size 18 and this is actually the brother of the pink one that fitted so badly and looked so horrible on me uh, this was only about nine pounds so the M&S jogger set uh, 15 pounds each now this this was a great bargain and I've put the label back on it because I did wear it but I really wanted to tell you about what a great bargain it is this is an A-line cut off denim skirt very simple it has pockets front and rear and I thought this is just a wardrobe staple it's I'm not really that girl that wears a denim midi length skirt but I liked the responsibly sourced cotton I liked that element of it it fitted and it looked quite cute on me but even better it was reduced from £30 to £9 How's that for a bargain? So basically I had to have it and cost per wear, even if I only wore it about three times, I'd be happy with that. The next piece is another bargain from John Lewis. Yes, I know I have a John Lewis problem. And I think my friend, my lovely, lovely friend, Megan of Train Girl Megan would approve. This is a cashmere, cashmere kind of cropped cardi buttoned thing not really my style not really my colour but again total bargain reduced from £90 to £44.50 for a bit of cashmere and when I tried it on uh, the hubby really really liked it on me and he does not like green so I knew it was a good good bet I actually feel really quite nice in it as well this is a top that the hubby actually picked out for me when we were in John Lewis a few weeks ago um, but they didn't have my size this is by Hush this is one of the pieces that had just arrived in the box today but these cuffs look at the cuffs I love it I absolutely love it I've tried this on this is staying this was another piece that was in the box today and this is a t-shirt by Thought it's v-neck and this is again I think a sustainable fabric choice it feels really lovely really lovely the sleeves are surprisingly long on it and I don't know how well they're going to stay cuffed because it's really really soft fabric so it just wants to flop um, but yeah that's another one that feels really really nice and that's staying uh, also by Thoughts and I've had this for a couple of weeks so you might have seen it on Instagram is this jumpsuit now again this kind of looks like it's camo print but it's um, flowers it's got an elasticated waist with a little pull thing here and it's got pockets it's a little bit long but it's not so long that I can't wear it with boots and trainers with a chunky sole and my chunky sandals in the summer so I'm really happy with that and this is the last thing that I wanted to show you. This is from Phase 8. The label isn't on it because I have popped it on a couple of times and then chosen not to wear it. But this is another jumpsuit. Yes. It's another wide leg jumpsuit. Um, this is the jumpsuit that I shall be wearing when I am doing some motor maintenance on our car because it looks just like that. The one day that I was going to wear this 
I said to the hubby I was going to wear my Gucci Balenciaga hacker scarf wrapped around my wrist like a little sort of sweat bandy type thing and I was going to carry my Louis Vuitton sac tricot in bright yellow to look like a little toolbox and he said please no please don't do that uh, so yeah I'm absolutely loving that it looks so cool so those are the things that I have bought but I hadn't shown you oh and that's just the clothes because I have bought footwear as well let's go and have a look at that okay this is the lineup right here in my messy messy room do you remember I had bought some beige kind of coloured um, boots from M&S in the vegan leather and I said I didn't fancy the look of the black ones I went back and got the black ones and I love them absolutely love them I also bought these from Marks and Sparks these are leather and they're a little bit muddy because we went for a walk with friends and ended up on some grass so I need to give those a clean but they are fantastic I've worn these loads I wear them to work and um, they're great for standing in as well at my stand-up desk at work and these are another pair of boots that I got from Marks and Sparks I got these ones and these ones on special and I think those ones were on um, sale when I bought them so I didn't pay full price for any of these and these are a pretendy suede. Looks like they'll scuff up pretty quickly, so I need to get those. They're actually scuffed up in the bag. I've got a little bit of colour transfer from the boot, from the base of this. Yeah, you can just see a little bit of discoloration there. Um, but that's going to happen with those because they're pretendy suede. Uh, so, yeah, I've bought three pairs of boots just as we're heading into spring. I am aware that that was quite a lot to go through. What a day, or what a week it's been. It is time for a little drinky, perhaps? What time is it? It's 20 past six. It's 20 past six now. Yeah, I might make a gin and tonic. Glass of wine. It's takeaway night, and we haven't decided what we're having yet. That's probably going to be the first thing to do. Oh, hello, babies. Hello. Oh, is it? Oh. Yeah? Oh, hello, Lily. Hello, Daisy. Is it dinner time? Dinner time for the babies. Dinner time for the trip hazards. <laughs> ah. Oh, Lily. Yeah. Daisy. Who's ready? You, Daisy, are you ready? Daisy? Lily, let Daisy talk. Daisy? Daisy? Yes, she oh. Here we go then, babies. Other side, please. Thank you. <laughs> They're so cute! Right, we couldn't order for delivery, so we had to run out and collect. This is my favourite Chinese, and we went simple today, didn't we? Lemon chicken. The lion's got a special egg fried rice. And I went for what the lion normally has, which is a beef chow mein. Because I quite fancied a beef chow mein. You a beef chow mein? Yeah, I know, and you didn't order it Is that why you were angry time. that I didn't have one? A little bit angry. Do you want to um, get on the drinks while I sort out food? <laughs> Mm, crack of goodness. Mm. Mm, so good. The hubby's plate of goodness. Your uh, monge too looks especially good. It is my plate of goodness. And this is the you shared... You could have done with some vegetables. Shared plate of good. I could have done with some vegetables, but I did have just veg last time, I think. concerned again about the shoulder drop. I think I must have body dysmorphia because sometimes I think I'm considerably bigger than what I am. People tell me I think that, but every time I look at a shoulder bag, I'm always worried that it's going to not going to fit over the shoulder. It's going to be right under my underarm and that's not a good move. Uh, 
but this one fits nicely. It's a little bit like the Louis Vuitton pushes. Lusa, they continue maintaining quality and they don't compare themselves to other brands because they don't have to. They're in it. There's my coffee. That's the hubby's latte. Little cheeky egg and ham sandwich. Toasted for brekkie. Just what we need. Hello. What a busy morning it's been already. We've been and done the food shop. The lions just dropped me off in town. He's going to go home, take the shopping, put it away. And I'm about to get my hair done. I didn't like the purpley bits last time. So I'll tell her I don't want that again. <laughs> Fresh, it's perfect. Who is she with her sunnies and her fresh hair? <gasps> Loving it. Now to do the taking back of the clothes. Oh, yeah, I forgot to show you. Bag of the day is Miss Neo Noe. Making myself use her. Right, off to the shops. didn't work out upsetting weird shaped earlobes that I have so not having those hubby didn't like the hoops although the hoops sat better on me but he didn't like them I sent him pictures bangles I didn't like the big bangles big sort of round ones and the little one was too small the little hinged one was too small to get on it didn't open up enough uh, so she's gonna see if they've got a medium that they can order in for me and then we started looking at the dangerous stuff the 18 karat white gold and diamond bangles <laughs> I was really shocked and really surprised when she told me the price of the three stone bangle because it didn't have a label on it so she had to go and find out uh, because the ten diamond ten diamond bangle same size everything else exactly the same just it had ten diamonds in it instead of three that one was seven nine nine five and the three was 6995 which doesn't make any sense to me at all she did say she's going to go away and uh, she's going to email me to see if she can get the Sean Lee and medium bangle in to try on and um, she's also going to give me their best price because I'm a returning customer uh, <laughs> on that other bangle but wow right so now I need to take clothes back and maybe have a little look around, who knows? with the sleeve detail. Look at this acid colour. I love it. I'm not so sure about the colour. But I love the colour. <gasps> this and my Versace tote. Yes. What do we think of the colour? What do we think of the collar? Tuck it in. 
in a bit. Does that work? Or does that not work? Oh, that's good. Pooped. Oh, let's put my stuff down. Making lots of old lady noises as I set myself down because I'm done in town and the lion is about to come and get me. Oh, I'm loving my hair. We went, it's a little bit shorter than it was. It's a little bit shorter at the back, a little bit longer at the front. It's been such a sunny, glorious day today. Um, I forgot to bring my crossbody strap for Miss Neo Nelly, so she's annoyed me a little bit having her over my arm. Look, look at my arm, where she's been. And am I regretting wearing jeans? And my MS vegan friendly booties. Uh, a little bit now, yeah, a little bit. I'm beginning to wish I was wearing Birkenstocks or something because uh, it is pretty damn warm. So that's it for the moment. Seriously, with this hair and these sunnies, who do I think I am? <laughs> And I forgot to tell you this morning that, um, oh my God, our Chinese takeaway was outstanding. It was gorgeous, it was beautiful, it was lovely, it was delicious, num, 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 num. Uh, yeah, so good. I'm so glad we found that place. Isn't it great when you find a great takeaway that does great food? Yes! You'll be really surprised to hear I've been busy since I got home with the girls, with the lion. Now, we are going on the second anniversary Zoom quiz. Two years we've been doing this on and off. <laughs> Nearly solidly for the first year. What are we doing, baby? We're doing a quiz. We are doing a quiz. Over Zoom. Over Zoom. We did this a lot in the first year and then it was like on and off for a bit after that. Christmas specials and things like that, so... See you later. Bye. Oh. And wish us luck. Exciting things are happening today. The road is being resurfaced and we've got this little car over here, right at the way back there, ignoring all the don't park on the road signs. Looks like it's about to be towed. Gosh, that's exciting. Further updates will be broadcast. Advanced technology, eh? They've kind of skimmed the top of it. You can see round, they've gone round the roundabout, skimmed it. So it looks like ding, ding, round two. There they go. It's just like watching curling at the Winter Olympics. 